Right, Shalom, Ya Shalom. I'm going to start off with all by giving all praise to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the Apostle GMS and honors to you, brothers, doing the work in truth, while sincerity. Now, I came across this video on my watch page, you know. YouTube, you know, said, recommended it to me for some reason. But, you know, um, you know, I found it funny just from the title alone. It says, Chocolate Covered Edomite Snaps. Right, so what they can understand is that you... you 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 have Edomites that look dark skinned but they can't understand the inverse because they you know they went you know before he found out that uh, her father was Irish and German he was he was just now oh, you're an Ed he he basically was referring to her as a sister he finds out that she's German Italian father you know um immediately she's an Edomite so you know let's just use his logic for a minute okay you have you can get dark skinned Edomites. Why, therefore, can you not understand the inverse of that, the opposite of that, which is you can get uh, light-skinned Israelites, Israelites that look like the so-called white man, white man. You know, because that's what he says about this woman. He's referring to this woman as an Edomite, despite being dark-skinned. You know, when you look through all the comments, man, I mean, you know, fuck are you, I see anyway. But it's just the irony of it. You know, they're, they're, they're base men. And one thing I noticed as well is in this video, he uses the line that uh, Gen was General Johannes said. You know, and Edomite comes up and says, do you hate white people? Right? And his answer was, we don't hate white people. God hates white people. Yo, man, I'll be honest with you, man. I hate Edomites. You know right? I hate Edomites. Look what they've done to our people. I hate them. You know, and I said Edomites as opposed to white people. Because you have Israelites that are so called white. You know, Israel's scattered throughout the whole earth, man. You know, if I was to, you know, this is Daniel 9 and 8. It says, O oh Lord, to us belongeth confusion of face, to our kings, to our princes, and to our fathers, because we have sinned against thee. Right? Because the Most High scattered us amongst the heathens, man. Look how many captivities Israel's been in. You're telling me we didn't fuck any of the Babylonians? Tell me we didn't deal with any of them Persians. You tell me we didn't deal with any of them Greeks. You tell me we don't deal with any of them Edomite women now, man. You see it, man. Blake Griffin, the example we always used. His father's a dark skinned man, married a white woman, brought out a mixed race, well quote unquote what this world referred to as a mixed race child. Right? He has he he lays down with another white woman. As in his son. And his son looks like an Edomite. Blonde hair, blue eyed kid. But as we, as we know from the scriptures. Numbers 1 and 18. You are what your father is. Right. It says I, Isaiah 11 and 11. And it shall come to pass. In that day. That the Lord shall set his hand again. The second time to recover the remnant of his people. Which shall be left. Right from Assyria. And from Egypt. And from Pathros. Let's look at where Pathros is. Um, if it was going to tell me, um, you know, it's, it's, in that, it's that area of reason, you know, from Kush and from Elam and from Shinar and from Hamath and from the islands of the sea, right? So basically, I'd say that Israel's all over the damn place, man. This is Deuteronomy 4 and 27, it says, And the Lord shall scatter, and Yahweh shall scatter you among the nations. That's playing into the point. We will be scattered amongst these heathens, man. Like I said, look how many captivities we've been in. You're telling me that, you know, uh, we won't have laid down with their women and won't have started looking like them. This is uh, Matthew 25 and 32. says, And before him shall be gathered all nations, and he shall separate them one from another, as a shepherd divideth his sheep from the goats. And he shall have, uh, he shall set the sheep on his right hand, but the goats on the left, man. You know, because you know we can do all this talking now, man. You know, you you, you see GMS on that camp. You know, you get some spirits. You know, well, you ain't a hundred percent sure. You know, you have an inkling of what they what they could be. We ain't a hundred percent sure, and you know, but we have an understanding that ultimately, it's the Lord that's going to separate the Israelites from the heathens, from the tares, man. You know, you 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 know, I can't man. We've seen tears, man. But then again, we've also seen Israelite foreigners, man. 
Hey man, we've got our camp is predominantly Israelite foreigners, man. You know, so now I'm just gonna end it and say shalom.